Good morning! Good morning! How are you today, my lovely readers? I hope you're doing well. So, I want you everyone to look at the picture and to guess what we are going to learn today. Oh, I know the story. It's a dive team story. We took this last week. And I think so today we're going to continue reading the story because last week we only read one page. Now we have one more page left to read. Well done! Correct! You are, you are right because last week we read only one page and today we are going to read the second page. So everyone, today we are going to read and read learn new things. So are you ready to explore new things today? Yes! Well done! So before we start, let's read the day and date. The so, day? Yeah, the day. The day is Wednesday and the date is May 6, 2020. Great! So everyone, also get your English book because we are going to use it and grab some pencils, please. So listen carefully and sit properly. So everyone, by the end of the lesson, you will be able to identify key ideas and details about main idea. So everyone, as I said to you that, you'll be able to identify key ideas and details about main idea. So while reading, we're going to look for the main ideas, okay? And we're going to learn how to use this graphic organizer. So everyone, I want you to open page 434, okay? I'm going to give you some time. Open page 434. This is the page, okay? Write the day and date, please. And tell me what can you remember about the story from last week? I can say that Gloria is an is a diver and also an underwater photographer. She takes pictures of her team's work and she also searches for sunken ships. Good? Well, fantastic! You can remember a lot of details about this story and also about Gloria. I am so proud of you. So everyone, what is the title of our text? Dive Teams. Okay, and I want to say something else. This is not a story. It's a text that gives information about dive teams. Okay? So it's not a story, everyone. And the genre of the text is expository text. So, I want you to listen carefully. Let's start reading together. Genre, expository text, dive teams. Essential question, why is teamwork important? Read about a team of divers who work together to explore a sunken ship. Imagine exploring the underwater world of the ocean. Perhaps you want to see how sea animals live, or you may hope to search for sunken ships. That is just what Gloria did. Gloria has always lived close to the sea in California. She swam and surfed at an early age. She became interested in the ocean. So Gloria became an expert diver. She decided to join a dive team to find sunken ships. What would her job be? Each job on a dive team is important. One serious job is using machines the dive team needs. 
Another job is to repair or fix these devices when they don't work. Gloria is an experienced photographer, so she decides to photograph what the team discovers underwater. Gloria and her team search for the sunken ship. Teamwork is important for a dive team. Team members depend on one another. They divide up the tasks and each person helps to get the job done. Gloria's team learns about a ship that sank over 100 years ago. No one has ever found it. They decide to make a scientific study of it. The team reads information and studies a map where they think the ship sank. They are excited about their exploration. The captain, another team member, takes them by boat to their map location. He stays on the boat where he can communicate with the divers. Before the team dives, they prepare for their special jobs. To get ready, Gloria puts on her diving suit and gear and makes sure her camera is ready to take photographs. Florida, Tallahassee, Tampa, Miami, Map Key, Red Star, Home Base, Anchor, Shipwreck, Dotted Line, Route. This map shows the route Gloria's team takes to the shipwreck. Now the divers jump into the water. As they swim deeper, it gets darker. A team member turns on a flashlight. This helps the divers see where they are going. Finally, one team member spots the ship. He uses an aquatic microphone to talk to the team. Gloria takes pictures as teammates measure the ship. Another teammate watches for sharks and other dangers. After an hour of exploring, the person with the flashlight leads the way back to the boat. The team now has important results from their discovery to share. Gloria thinks, I will always remember this dive. The team believes the ship Gloria heard about sank near other known shipwrecks off the coast of Florida. Make connections. Why is teamwork important for exploring shipwrecks? Would you enjoy being part of a team that explores shipwrecks? Explain your answer. So everyone, diving or, you know, swimming in the ocean or in the sea, let me say, it's not that easy, right? Because as I said to you so far, people can't breathe underwater and they need to be careful and also to take a lot of things with them. Gloria is a diver, right? And also she's a photographer. And she will dive with a group of divers. So they will go to uh, the ocean or to dive in the, in, the, in the deep ocean as a team. And they were looking for a sunken ship. Well done. So, because as you can. So everyone, diving in the ocean and looking for sunken ships is not that easy because you need to take with you a lot of things. For example, machines and diving kit, maps and a lot of things. That's why you need to go with a group of people and we call them team when you go with a group of people and you work together you are a team see that here are some pictures for sunken ships do you see them everyone yes yeah they are deep in the ocean do you see the these ships yes yeah so glory and her team are looking for such ships okay everyone so everyone let's talk about the main idea of this page the main idea is something very important we need to pay attention to it and the main idea for uh, or of this page is each job and a dive team is important okay so the details are here so using machines the dive team needs repair or fix devices machines when they don't work 
photograph what the team discovers underwater. So when you go diving, you can go alone. Uh, you need a group of people to go with you because uh, each one of them will have uh, his own job. Some of them will use machines, some of them will fix these machines and the other ones will take uh, pictures and you know we can call it group work okay in page 436 the main idea is teens exploration teens exploration okay so glorious team finds out about a ship that sank over 100 years ago so the details let's read them together detail number one Glorious team finds out about a ship that sank over 100 years ago. Detail number two, the team reads information and studies a map where they think the ship sank. Detail number three, the final one, they are excited about their exploration. So let me say they found out a map, okay, and the map is about a sunken ship. And they were very happy and excited to explore and also to find the location of the sunken, sunken ship. Yes, well, how they will do that? They will follow the map because there is a map and they will follow the map. And everyone remember uh, in the science subject, we have studied about maps, right? And we said that maps are very important. And we can use them for many reasons, right? And in the story, they're using the map to find the sunken ship. So, as I said to you, the main idea of this page is Teams Exploration. Okay, and if you want to talk in details about Teams ex Exploration, we will say that they first, or the details of this idea is Glorious Team found out about a ship. The team reads information and studies a map where they think the ship sank. They are very excited about their exploration. So we talked about this idea in details. So everyone, let's move to page 437 and read the points over here. I want you to listen carefully, everyone. So let's read it together. The divers work together. One person uses a flashlight to help the team see in the dark. What? Okay, so everyone, as you can see, it's dark in the ocean. That's why they need someone to use uh, the flashlight so they can see in the dark water. One team member uses a microphone to talk to everyone on the team. So everyone, also, because you are so deep in the ocean, you need a microphone uh, to communicate and call uh, someone from the team because at the end you need to go out from the ocean, right? Another teammate watches for dangers while another measures the sunken sh ship. Gloria takes pictures. So everyone, as you know that, the ocean is very dangerous and also uh, there are some tea animals as shark, you know, uh, in the ocean. That's why you, you need someone to watch for the dangers, okay? And also Gloria's job is to take pictures so I want you everyone to listen carefully listen dive teams this is expository text Gloria and her team of divers explore a sunken ship members of a dive team do many different jobs Gloria takes pictures of what the dive team find other team members use and repair the machines the team needs others read a map Another member communicates with the divers who are underwater. Someone else watches for sharks. They will all share the exciting discoveries. 
So, so Gloria and her team <coughs> of divers explore a sinking ship. Okay. <coughs> Members of dive te team, sorry, do many different jobs. Gloria takes picture of what the dive team finds. Other team members use and repair the machines that the team needs. Okay, so here there are two jobs. One of them for Gloria because Gloria takes pictures of what the dive team finds. And the other one is uh, to fix and repair machines the team needs. Others read a map. Another member communicates with the divers who are underwater. As you can see, some of them or others read the map. Others communicate with the divers who are underwater. Someone else watches for sharks because, as I said to you, the ocean is very dangerous. And um, they will all share the exciting discoveries. So everyone, what is the main idea over here? The main idea is each job is important. Great, because each job is important. Each one of them has his own job. Some of them uh, take pictures, some of them read maps, some of them repair and fix machines, and so on. So, read page 437 again. Complete the key details in the graphic organizer, okay? So, everyone, here, the main idea is Teamwork is important for a diving team. This is the main idea, okay? So the details are one person uses a flashlight to who can say to to help the to team help the team see in the dark. Water. Well done. And one team member uses a microphone to communicate with the team yeah to talk and communicate with a team and another teammate watches for dangers well done 